Smells like you in the morning, Mike. <laughs> nice travel grinning kit. Oh, look at this. Mike. Right off the top, just this case, I can just see just the corner. Oh man, look at that. 1980 Mattel. How we doing today, Robert Zaba Auctionaire Extraordinaire with Second Sense Auctions. And guess what? I bought this unit online. A few pictures. It's a 10 by 15. I paid. $300, okay? The way I looked at it, what is that, two bucks a square foot? Something like that, yeah. That's a, So, it's pretty cheap in the in the storage unit game because you only need a little tiny square foot to make all your money You know back. what, though? If, if it's stacked to the ceiling, you can figure it out in cubic feet, and it's even less. That'd be conky smart, <laughs> you know? But he, he does calculations. Yeah. Me, no calculations for <laughs> myself. So let's see what I got myself into. Obviously, I brought back up some. Right, Chach? Yeah. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> you want a frozen unit. But you hear we don't have to do this. No. So he probably know. kicks the unit just for the last set. One, two. Oh, 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 I see all kinds. Oh, 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 yes. Yes. Oh. yes. I mean, this is what I saw, ladies and gentlemen. This is one of the reasons I bought the unit right here and then right there. Titan Tron Live and this. And then look back there, you see there's cases, boxes, 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 all these bags. Who knows what's underneath these bags? There's lots, lots of stuff in here, guys. I'm excited. What do you think, Colin? I'm excited. I haven't even gotten into it. Look at all the dust. Look at all the dust. Look at this. Cobwebs. Crutches. Oh, right there. Right there. Is that a little 22? Looks like a 22. Wow. I think that puts you. I, yeah. I don't know. Model MP25, 25 caliber. Raven Arms Industry. You always make sure it's unloaded. Box, nasty, filthy. Looks like it's falling apart. I just hope the stuff inside's not damaged. Oh, oh look at that. Guys, guys, guys. Ooh, yes, ooh, yes. Real yes. riders. Look at this, guys. This whole box is filled, loaded oh. on the card. Hot Wheels, you Mad gotta Fox, be kidding me! More trains. We got seal trains. Real riders. You know what these things are worth? That's probably thirty bucks right there at minimum. Another ten, fifteen, easy. And this whole thing is just built. Check. Oh my gosh! Comfy, I'm unbelievable. Wow! Wow! Look at all. Holy! Nice. I had that when I was a kid. Brand new on the card. Another rear ride. That's got to be another 40 bucks right there. And I mean, who knows what else is in here? The school bus? What year is this? Uh, 80s. 80s, yeah. Oh, what's that? Slot car? No, I don't think so. Uh, I don't think so. It's just the land we need. I don't see any evidence of slot car stuff in here, but those are real riders, Rob, are worth. Ooh, let me see that. That's a red line. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's a promotional. This How was one of the last years. How much do you think that's worth? Um, in the baggie like that, uh, you could easily get 70, 80 bucks out of that. Guys, look at this. Nice, train, nice, train nice. Track. Who knows what else is in here? Unbelievable stuff. Yeah, Conky's excited. I mean, this is why I buy this stuff, guys. I mean, where are you going to find this stuff? Oh, there's more red lines. I mean, the word. here's another. Yep, that's the funny car. That body lifts up on that. 90s that or 83. Wow, guys. So you think I'm gonna make my money? I think you're gonna make your money on this. You, you could get your money for the whole unit out of that box. And probably then some. And then some, at least. Only guys. Wow. So these are all the boxes we'll have to go through at the warehouse, ladies and gentlemen. Look at all this stuff left. We've already been loading, loading, loading. Hello everybody, how we doing today? Robert Zaba, auctionaire extraordinaire, Second Sense Auctions, and once again, 
I have all of this stuff from this $300 unit I purchased in Akron, Ohio. And you guys seen me and Conky have our battle. You seen the first video. Unbelievable vintage goodness from toys. We found jewelry. We found coins. We found so much great stuff. I'm so excited. This is all stuff we didn't have time to film. All these boxes we haven't gone through yet. This whole table is loaded up. So let's see what else we can find. Once again, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Hit the bell. Get all your notifications. And you can actually buy the stuff you see at www.secondsense.com. www.secondsense.com. First box. Let's see what it says. Okay. What? Well, that's a good sign, I guess. I guess. Winnie the Pooh. He's got his honey, too. So this looks like a little light-up honey jar in there. Oh, And then you got little baby Winnie the Pooh. So these people were collectibles. They love toys. And I gotta say, yay, hooray for this unit. What is this? Oh, look at this. Brand new. Things for your bathroom. I guess you put these on to hang towels on. Robe hook. Ooh, fancy, Mike. You need a robe hook? I have one. You already have one? Mm hmm Boogie Bobbers. I don't know what a Boogie Bobbers, but you could try them. Speak, singer, tap on package. Hello. Hello. <laughs> what the? Oh. So like a little art kit, office kit kind of thing. What a weird little unit it's been. Core action. Coca Cola. Uh, empty tin. So. What? What? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas. Aluminum Santa Claus trays. Nice. So. And then we got something on the bottom here. Oh, oh, oh. Is this vintage game like your favorite. Pizza. It is my favorite. Pizza party. Well, that's a don't... good classic right there. I can't believe I don't have that. 1987, Mike. Wow. So we have a little pizza party action. Interesting, interesting. Oh! Oh, wow. Look at this. Bond. James Bond. It looks like we got a whole James Bond collection right here. And these are still sealed. Never open. Live to die, Dr. No. Still sealed. Thunderball. Octopussy. Goldfinger. Wow. Pretty interesting. It's got to wear something, all the sealed ones, huh? Mm hmm. Who knows? Ooh, Moonraker. Moonraker, that's a good one. Still got the Muppets in here. Believe it or not, VHS tapes, sealed ones, they have some value. So you just never... Oh. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Look at this, Mike. It's got <laughs> pants stuff. There we go. A lamp. So we got a little, uh, what do they call those, wind socks, Mike? Oh, yeah. Ready for Halloween decor? No? <laughs> uh -oh. Welcome. Mike has one that says, Get out! <laughs> All right, Mike. That's right. Go away. Go away. There's a bike seat. Oh, this is interesting down here, Mike. This is getting interesting here. I see like cologne, and perfume, far away, $10 price tag on it, Ava, black suede. <laughs> <laughs> smells like you in the morning, Mike. <laughs> nice travel green kit. Oh, look at this, Mike. Might 
Okay, sterling earrings, huh? Hmm. Interesting. So we got some earrings. That's a good sign, Mike. Who knows what else could be in here? I always love these little bathroom ones. Teddy bear. Candle. Jordan necklace. Ooh, here's a little box. Box like. Meow, You feeling lucky? Sure. I gotta wear this, Mike. That'll get us lucky, you know. I feel better now. <laughs> So we got jewelry, more jewelry, collectibles. I mean, we got so many more boxes to go through. Let's see what's in this bag here. It's like a, oh, it says Mickey Mouse on it. I'll give this to you after we're done, Mike. <laughs> okay, look at this. Hodgepodge of mess of stuff. Brand new one touch. Hmm. Look at that. It's still sealed. There's a price tag on here, $72.99. Oh, look at that. Cleveland Browns notebook. Ohio State Buckeyes. Okay. Oh, what's this? Knife collection. Oh. Yeah, see, these are the kind of bags we have to go through every little inch. You just don't know. See, there's all kind of little things in here. I mean, this thing's packed full of stuff. There's Ireland 2010 calendar. Who doesn't need one of those? There's this thing. Looks like some kind of video game. Pro 200 gaming system. No more lonely nights for you, Mike. <laughs> you play some Pro 200. Pro gaming system. Probably the best one ever. What's this? It says wings as an eagle or something. Oh, here we go. All right. Look at that. Ooh, that's nice. Nice little watch there. So you have different ones you go around. You can change the different uh, the look of it. So, finding some jewelry and stuff. Like, like these, look at this. Brand new Barbie toy. Just in this bag of, you would just think, most people would open it up and say, this is garbage. I want to throw the whole thing out. Mike and I know better than that, especially in this game. There's no rhyme. There's no reason. You know, on the bottom of this bag could be, a gold ring or hundred dollar bill or some vintage toy or Jimi Hendrix record, you don't know. <laughs> oh Mike. That's right. Keep digging. You gotta dig, you gotta look, and I'll go through it better when I empty it in the trash. What haters in life? Hatters? Oh haters. Ha <laughs> ha Oh I get it. It's the Red Hat Society. <laughs> and then we got this little Coca-Cola mirror. Wash, but if, right, and now I'm looking. We got Beauty and the Beast. Sing it, Mike. Oh, look at these. These gotta be worth some money. Here are some vintage Care Bears. What was your favorite Care Bear, Mike? Uh, I didn't have one. Just make up a name, Mike. Come on, man. <laughs> don't, don't ruin it for the kids out there, man. Or, what was your favorite Care Bear, Joe? Grumpy Bear, man. Grumpy Bear, see? <laughs> Joe knows what to do. Make my wish. So this whole thing looks like it's collectible stuff, except for maybe this one here. But we got Raggedy Ann and Andy. Kermit the Frog. 
the Hunchback of Notre Dame. So all collectible plusher. Cookie Monster. Hey, Cookie Monster! And of course, you can't have a good box without Santa Claus. It's like Christmas all day. Mickey Mouse. So collectible plush. It's not just regular stuffed animals. They're all ones people recognize. You got vintage ones. Disney, Care Bears, who knows what else. We got more boxes to go through. I can't wait to see what else we find. Yes, it is cold in Cleveland. You can see my breath there. More boxes of fun, like. Uh oh. Walking stick. Stop! <laughs> what? Holy Ooh. smoke. Toys and more toys. This is like all like Happy Meal toys that are, look like all Disney Happy Meal stuff. Look at Little Mermaid. I mean, Hercules. So who knows? We got more Little Mermaid and Donald Duck in here. All collectible stuff in here. Puff the Magic Dragon. This guy. It's an angry bird. Ooh. King stuff. I mean, just goes on. Um, more Mickey Mouse, Bambi. Let's take a look at all of this. Though. So Disney toys, Disney toys, more Disney toys. Like, and that, ooh, and a little, oh, little girl's jewelry. So maybe, maybe they gave her something good, Mike. Maybe. Come on, I know this open. Maybe this top just comes out then. Something has to happen here. There's gotta be a way to get to the bottom, Mike. Uh, maybe it's fake paper. Right. So, paper. Boo. Boo. So it's definitely worth some money and even the Rubik's. The Rubik's Cube. How fast can you do the Rubik's Cube, Mike? Uh, 37 seconds. Nice. I think you can do it fast. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool. Take a look at this thing. It's the light up globe, but what makes it way better? You see what's on there? No. Oh. It's all Disney. Wow, Disney globe. You got the Jungle Book and Seven Dwarfs, Hercules, Dumbo on a globe. I've never seen a Disney globe like this. It lights up. Here's the stand for it. Oh, neat. So we'll have to put it all back together. And I know that's got to be worth some money. Who doesn't want a Disney globe, Mike? Don't say you don't. I do. Speaking of Disney, look at this. <laughs> Holy VHS. And believe it or not, these are actually collectible. And then there's the notorious black diamond ones out there. They're supposedly worth tons and tons of money. You ever hear about the Black Diamond Disney movies? No, what are those about? Oh my gosh. You haven't lived yet, Mike. You haven't lived yet. I haven't. So, four more boxes to go through. Let me grab another one. Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday to Mike. Get some Sesame Street. Disney Channel case. It's empty though. So weird stuff. A brand new candle. And there's no rhyme, no reason. May God's love warm your home. <laughs> May God's love. Oh! Records on top. Then we got books, books, Toy Story. Oh, look at this! Talk about vintage goodness. Was this a bananas? Bananas. Yeah. Free poster inside. Michael, who's the free poster? Is it still on there? Uh, I think that was a children's magazine from the eighties. I'd say so. And yeah, talk about classic goodness. So it's kind of like a mad magazine. 
Pretty cool. <laughs> Look at all the 45s in here. Ooh. Europe. All Sunny I shirt. ever need is sun and share. Duran Duran. Yeah. Definitely, we got Frosty the Snowman. These are all look at these records Winnie the Pooh Disney records. Definitely have some value. Oh, we got more records down here. Mark. Holy smoke! This whole thing is just filled with records. John Cougar, Sunny and Cher. Look at them. Grease. Grease lightning. We got rabbit. Oh, what's this? So we definitely have some money in records. Not in the greatest condition, but Quiet Riot. These are records people are looking for. 70s, 80s, and of course some Disney records, Mike. What else is in here? Oscar the Grouch. Picture frame. Interesting, interesting. So unit, lots of vintage goodness. Too much good stuff. <laughs> My name is Joe Cool. <laughs> That's Joe Cool. Personified right there. Looks like Wayne Poop. We got a Disney bag in here. Eagle toy, Winnie the Pooh plate, more Winnie the Pooh, and something in the box. It says Jiggle Heads Maltel. I'm going to have to imagine it's probably Winnie the Pooh. I'm going to guess. This, everything else in here seems to be. <laughs> so they collected Winnie the Pooh, records, toys, all kind of great stuff. Man, we have so many more boxes to go through. All right, I'm gonna grab another stack of boxes. Oh! It's a maniac. Got some hats in here. Lots of hats. What else is in here? Bunch of plastic, something. Little plastic baggies. And we got a poker. It's in there. A bunch of little stuffed animals. Looks like Toucan Sam. So, not, nothing too fabulous, also. So we got a bunch of tapes in here, Mike. Winnie the Pooh. Oh! What's that? Look at it. Ooh. Say original Yoda. Yeah. No caper weapons. Oh, right here. Look. A Chewy. Two Star Wars guys are right on top. That's a good sign. Maybe there's more in here. Wrestling fanatic. That's you can have it, Mike. <laughs> oh, look at this! Vintage ET. Ooh, I never seen that. Oh, Cabbage Patch Kid. Strawberry Shortcake. It's like an '80s box Wonderland in here. More Strawberry Short Shortcake. There's all kind of. Tapes and Rod Stewart, Billy Joel. Poodle. This thing. <laughs> it's a suave little snug fit rubber. 
around here. You just don't know what the kind of, these kind of boxes. You just gotta you really have to go through every. Vintage ET guy. Looks like this is all seashells. Found by the seashells. Bag of shells, another Strawberry Shortcake figure, and uh, Florida. Look at that. Onion. So there's a whole set of these by Lennox. I wonder if they have the rest of the set. This is the only one they have. If you find the rest of the set, that could be some money, ladies and gentlemen. Money, money, money. That's probably a hundred some dollar set. Oh, the other ET figure. Man, look at all this. That's the thing, man. You just don't know. You have to go through everything. Ghostbusters movie soundtrack. So. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, I was waiting to see if I could find another Star Wars figure or something on the bottom here. Get some more jewelry. Celtics pencil. Interesting. Wow. Right, what we got in this box? I just think it's all closed. And look down here. Wow, wow, wow. Look at more. We got bobblehead Minnie Mouse. Crazy goofy bobblehead. <laughs> or bobble butt, I guess. <laughs> it's not funny, man. It is. And this whole thing says Disney, Winnie the Pooh, and. Look at the Pluto bobblehead. Oh, no. Don't make me mad, Mike. Mulan. So it's just all Disney. Plates, everything. So, some clothes on top. Never judge a box by the top. Gotta look through the whole thing, Mike. Oh, That's right. Mike knows. Oh. Once again, if you guys haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. Take a look at all of our past videos. Too much good stuff. Let's see what we got. Wait. Oh, right. right off the top, just this case. I can just see. Just the corner. Oh man, look at that. 1980 Mattel. See that, Mike? Mm hmm. Golden Dream Barbie case right there. Oh, man. oh, there's more. There's more down there. First, let's take a look at this. Let's see what's inside. Anything? Is it empty, Mike? Yeah, it's full of Barbies. It's full of Barbies! Oh. Or Ken's. We got Ken and Barbie. So we got two Barbies and two Kens. Wow. That is cool. Now, where do you see this? Fashion doll case? Who knows what could be in here? Is that Barbie or is that Sunny Share? And these are some vintage Barbies right here. These look like 70s right here. Years on this case. No year. But I'm really excited about what's in here. Because I've seen a lot of different things. But I've never seen this one before. This is the first time I've ever seen this case. The berries. Like strawberry shortcake. Yeah. Look at this. Oh, Dude, it is loaded. Vintage. Goodness, original, 
with all the pets. I remember these, my sister had all these. And this is the guy, this is him. Yes! <laughs> this is the guy I used to be when I played with my sister when I was a kid. And, oh, all right, here it is, here it is. Here's his bird. And they all smell like different things. But he's got his spoon, he's got the mustache, it's probably always missing, because that pops right out. He's got the bird. This whole thing is, I mean, look at, we got figures. We got all the little figures in here. Lemon meringue, blueberry. I'm trying to think of all their names right now, but. And we got different sort of shortcakes, different variety ones of her. Man. Orange blossom. Wow. And guess what? It's not over, Mike. It's not. Vintage goodness has not ended. We found Star Wars figures. We found strawberry shortcakes. Look at this. More strawberry shortcake figures. And some of these are the original ones. And then look at that's his wife. The other one, she's got the snake. I think it used to smell like grapes. Yep, she used to smell like grapes. You got their hats in here. So, I mean, it's a whole box full of Barbie, strawberry shortcakes. Definitely money, money, money all day long. I mean, this case here, complete. Who knows? Could be $50, could be $100. I don't know. I'm not up to date on strawberry shortcake figures, Mike. I'll have to ask him later <laughs> what the market's like nowadays. He likes Star Wars and strawberry shortcake. It's two things he knows about. <laughs> Maybe not sure short game, but Star Wars, okay. <laughs> I don't even know if he's just... What's a... Oh, man. Is this thing loaded with what I think it is? Oh, my gosh. You guys are going to have to check back tomorrow. See what's in this box. We've still got all these boxes still to go through. Who knows what else we're going to find. Man, I'm excited. Keep